Hi, I'm James Rogers. Today, I'm going to talk about the common male names in English-speaking countries. I'm going to give you the top 75 that often occur in the US, Canada, the UK, Ireland, Australia, and New Zealand, give you alternative spellings, and nicknames for each when they exist. Before I get into the list, let me explain a bit about why I made it. Knowing the common names of the people who speak a language, it's common knowledge for fluent speakers. They are learned in school because classmates and teachers have them, by knowing your neighbor's names, and via family and friends. However, this is usually not taught in ESL classrooms or textbooks, so many students lack this basic knowledge when they go abroad. This can lead to embarrassing situations such as mispronouncing a very common name. It also shows a lack of international experience. So I set out to do a research project to choose names to teach. I looked at data from the most common names in the US, Canada, the UK, Ireland, Australia, and New Zealand, and I made a master list of the top 75 that occur often in all the countries. I also made note of any names that have entered the top uh, 75 recently because of immigration, such as the high frequency of certain Spanish names because of immigration to the US from Spanish-speaking countries such as Mexico. I hope the information I will provide is useful for you. Okay, let's get into the list. I'm going to say the name and any nicknames that exist so that you can confirm the pronunciation. I'll also mention any special information if it exists for the name. And I recommend paying attention to any alternative spellings that are listed on the sides. Okay, here we go. Adam. Alan. Al. Alexander. Alex, Andrew, Andy, Drew, Anthony, Tony, Tone, Ant, Benjamin, Ben, Benny, Brandon, Bran, Brian, Bry. Bruce, Charles, Charlie, Chuck, Christopher, Chris, Colin, Craig, Daniel, Dan, Danny, Darren, Dar, Darry, David, Dave, Davy, Dennis, Dan, Denny, Donald, Don, Donnie, Edward, Ed, Eddie, Eric, Ethan, Frank, Frankie, Gabriel, Gabe, Gary, Gar, George, Georgie, Gerald, Jerry, Gregory, Greg, Henry, Hank, Ian, Jack, Jacob, Jake, James, Jim, Jimmy, Jimbo. Actually, so this is my name. Um, I actually hate Jim or Jimmy or and definitely not Jimbo. When I went to school, uh, lots of the kids in my uh, class uh, they all called me that, and I hated it, but they were my good friends, so I just let them. But I really prefer James, so it really depends on the person. 
Um, but I really don't like Jim or Jimmy, especially Jimbo. But they, a lot of people called me that. Uh, but I always tell people, yeah, I prefer James. Okay, anyway. Anyway. Jason. Jay. Jeffrey. Jeff. John. Johnny. Jonathan. John. Johnny. Jordan. Jordy. Jose. Now, note that this is uh, the Spanish version of Joseph, and also note the special pronunciation. Um, some uh, The words with a J in Spanish, they're pronounced with an H sound. Uh, not always, but often. So, Jose. It's not Jose. It's Jose. Also, please note the um, accent mark on top of the E. Now, to make the accent mark in when you have an English uh, keyboard, it's, it doesn't come up so easily. Most English speakers don't know how to do it. But if you want to write the name properly in Spanish, you, have, you should have the accent mark. But in the English-speaking countries, we often just don't write it. Um, but I added it here just so you can notice. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Joseph. Joe, Joey, Joshua, Josh, Juan. Okay, this is an, another Spanish name. Uh, it's the Spanish version of John. Very, very common in Spanish-speaking countries. And notice that this time it's not the H sound. Um, it's the W sound, wa. Juan. It's not Juan, it's Juan. So very, very common name. So you'll you'll encounter this very often in the United States. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Justin. Kenneth. Ken. Kenny. Kevin. Kev. Lawrence, Larry, Lar, Mark, Martin, Marty, Matthew, Matt, Maddie, Michael, Mike, Mikey, Mohammed. Okay, so this is an Arabic name, and there's a huge um, increase in immigration from um, the Middle East to countries such as the UK. So Mohammed is uh, entered their top uh, top fifty, and this name um, has so many different spelling variations because it comes from Arabic. It's not really an English name, so yeah, just be careful about the spelling. Okay, on to the next one. Nathan, Nate, Neil, Nicholas, Nick, Nikki, Noah. Okay, I'll just stop here for a second and mention uh, so many of the names uh, in English-speaking countries, they come from the Bible. They come from the followers of Jesus um, and so on. And Noah is one of the main uh, people that's discussed in the Bible. Um, so uh, names like Gabriel and so on. Many of the saints such as St. James, St. Paul, St. John and so on. So that's just something to pay attention to. That's where these names originally come from. Now, if you have that name, that doesn't necessarily mean that your family is religious um, or not. It's just a common name. Okay. Anyway, so on to the next. Oliver. Ollie. Patrick. Pat. Patty. This name in particular is very, very popular in Ireland, but uh, it's also popular in America because we have so many Irish Americans. In fact, there's more Irish Americans than people in Ireland. 
Anyway, on to the next one. Paul, Polly, Peter, Pete, Petey, Philip, Phil, Raymond, Ray, Richard, Rich, Richie, Robert, Rob, Robbie, Bob, Bobby. This one might seem strange, but every once in a while we do have these nicknames that are not really logical. So um, the most uh, famous one that had this name was Bobby Kennedy, uh, the brother of uh, John F. Kennedy, the president of the United States, uh, who was uh, killed a long time ago. Okay, on to the next one. Ronald, Ron, Ronnie, Ryan, Rye, Samuel, Sam, Sammy, Scott, Scotty, Sean, Shane, Simon, Stephen, Steve, Stevie, Timothy, Tim, Timmy, Thomas, Tom, Tommy. I'll just stop here for a second and mention uh, something important. Um, if you study the family names uh, of uh, common family names of English, you'll also notice that many first names are often also last names. So names like Thomas or James, those are common family names as well. But many of the names on the list are not, so just pay, pay attention to that. Okay, next one, Vincent, Vin, Vinny. Um, this name, a very, very popular Italian name. So Italian Americans will often have this name. Okay, next one, Wayne, William, Will, Willie, Bill, Billy. Okay, so that's the last one. And did you notice that in some of the um, alternative spellings or nicknames, sometimes they end in an IE and sometimes in a Y or both? So for Billy, I only listed with the Y. Why did I do that? Well, actually, Billy with an IE, um, that's uh, sometimes a, a common uh, female name. So the males will avoid writing it because that's particularly female, um, just to avoid confusion. Uh, it's probably because of the really, really famous singer, Billie Holiday, and she had, her name was spelled with an IE. So um, also sometimes we don't add the IE just because the way it looks or some other reason like that. So. Uh, often there's both, but sometimes you only have one option, and that's why I just wrote those particular ones. Okay, so that's it, and good luck studying, everyone.